While you're at HudKing.com, click on the T to follow us on Twitter, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, or put a street name or zip code in the search bar to see other HUD homes in your area. If you're watching this on YouTube, click the subscribe button to be notified of new uploaded videos. We are here at 7327 Longing Trail over in Ventura. That's 7327 Longing Trail, a nice three bedroom, two bath home. Approximately 1,400 square feet, built in 1986. Exterior of this home is a combination of brick and wood siding. That's a neat little porch. Big mature tree up front. And exterior wise, is in pretty decent condition. The home sits on about a 6,000 square foot lot. And we're over kind of on the northeast side or the east side of San Antonio, sort of near Converse. Let's look at the backyard, then we'll look at the inside. Well, we step into the backyard through the sliding glass door, and there is a small patio in the back. It's not covered, but it does have a small little slab here. As you can see, there currently aren't any neighbors directly behind your lot. You do have some space back there, and it's a decent sized lot. You could definitely do a lot with it. A rear view of the home. Uh, the roof, if you look at the roof, there are some shingles that look like they have been patched. So you may want to have that looked at in the near future. And then there's a little bit of damaged siding around the chimney here. They kind of used a cheap sort of a siding back in the 80s, which is this. It's sort of like a fibrous compound board. And there's a little bit of trim damage around some of the windows and the doors, but that's actually very easy to fix. I would recommend coming back with a little hardy plank, which is a cement board fiber. Let's take a look at the inside. Well, before we walk in, I have to tell you, I think this porch is really, really nice. A very nice covered porch here. And we step in, it does have ceramic tile, and it has a laminate wood flooring inside. So the very first room we walk into is your living room. It has a fireplace, which is a nice touch. You have your dining room here, the little seating area. And then we come over and we have your kitchen. Not a huge kitchen, but the home in and of itself is not very big. It's, like I said, about 1,400 square feet. Pretty much a starter home, but nice nonetheless. It's about 4,000 underneath the county appraisal. You do have an indoor laundry room and pantry combined here. And then we have the two-car garage. Now, if you'll notice, one side of the garage is a little bit shallow. The other side is obviously deep. So if you have one car to put on this side, it's going to be a ton, kind of a tight squeeze. Now, one perk about this home is the master bedroom is downstairs. And when you come in from the front door, the master bedroom is to the right here. So we'll come into the master bedroom. Now, as you can see, it does look like there was a bit of ceiling damage, so maybe a, a water leak or maybe condensation on that AC vent. Sometimes that happens and they looks like they patched it. It just needs to be retexturized. It does have laminate wood floors. Now, an interesting thing about the setup of this bathroom is you have the master bathroom access here. It's a single vanity. It is a little damaged in the corner there, so you may want to go ahead and replace that vanity, which is not hard to do. They put ceramic tile on the floor in here. It does have a shower and garden tub combo, so it's a big garden tub and shower. And then you have your uh, walk-in closet here for your master bedroom. Nice closet, it does have some built-ins. Now, if you want to use the commode from the master bedroom, you come through this door here, and you have a commode and vanity in here. And this is so if your guests were to be over that they don't have to go upstairs to use the bathroom, so they do share the commode and vanity in that room with the master. Sort of avoids having to have a half bath. And we come up and the other two bedrooms will be upstairs. The carpet is a little bit dirty. You'll probably want to replace that. When we get upstairs, if we continue straight, we have bedroom number two. Decent little bedroom. It's going to need a fresh coat of paint, some flooring, and possibly some closet doors, unless you wanted to leave that open like that. And then we have around the corner here, full bathroom number two. It has laminate wood floors, a single vanity, and a shower and tub combo, and full bathroom number two. Pretty basic. And then bedroom number three. Bedroom number three, fresh coat of paint, some flooring. And for some reason they put a little window unit there, so it may, I don't know, you may want to have the AC serviced and get that checked out, but you definitely can do that. HUD will give you 15 days to get a, an inspection done if you're an owner occupant. Let me give you a summary. Well, there it is, guys, 7327 Longing Trail. That's 7327 Longing Trail over in Ventura, a very charming three bedroom. Two bath, two story starter home. As I mentioned, it's about $4,000 underneath the county appraisal. You could own this home and have monthly payments right around $800 to $825 a month. So that's incredible when you think about owning a home versus an apartment. The home is listed right now for only $86,100. So if you're interested in it and you don't have a realtor, I'd love to earn your business. 
You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan. I'm the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.